ZTE Blade S6, a smartphone made by a Chinese company, ZTE, designed to look almost identical to the Apple iPhone 6. So let's go ahead and unbox this device to see just how similar it is to the iPhone here on PhoneDog. Hey, what is up, Phone Dogs? Bo HD here, and I just wanted to share this Chinese device with you to see what your thoughts are of it. I ordered it from a Chinese site called geekbuying.com. I'll leave the link for you to check that out down below if you want to check it out. Now, judging by the appearance of the box, it doesn't really look like an Apple product. I mean, from the outside of the box, it actually kind of reminds me of a Samsung device with the Samsung packaging. The S6 in the name doesn't really help with that either, but we can get inside this box by slicing off the tape on the left and right hand side of the box with our trusty Bow HD unboxing knife. Then it just slides off like so, and we will find the ZTE Blade S6 sitting right on top. Now before I go ahead and start to undress it, I do want to set it off to the side because we will find some more goodies inside of the box. First of all, there's a little warranty card directly beneath the Blade S6. Then we have a little container that holds the standard micro USB charging cable as well as some standard ZTE setup information in both Chinese and English. The other little compartment is home to a wall charger, which as you can see is obviously not made for the US, but this probably is a good time to tell you that the Blade S6 does work with AT&T and T-Mobile, but you will need to unlock the device. Now that's everything in the box, so if we go ahead and take a look at the Blade S6, we'll see that we have this little plastic cover that mentions some specs like Hi-Fi audio, smart sense, dual nano SIM, LTE, and a Qualcomm Snapdragon 615 processor, as well as Android 5.0. We'll get to that stuff in a sec, but we just need to admire the design and just take a look at how much similar it is to the iPhone 6. It has round edges, and the back has a sort of metal appearance similar to the iPhone 6, but it's made entirely of plastic. Even the placement of the ZTE logo and the 13 megapixel camera sensor and flash is almost identical. The icing on the cake though is definitely the designed by ZTE in California text on the bottom of the phone. Man, that made me laugh when I first saw it. But if we take a further look around the device, we will find the power sleep on off button and volume rocker on the right hand side, the dual nano SIM card slot on the left hand side, there's a 3.5mm headphone jack up top, a micro USB charging port down below at the bottom. The front of the Blade S6 is home to a 5 megapixel front facing camera sensor as well as some ambient light sensors. There's a 5 inch 720p display below that. And then there are three capacitive touch navigation buttons, although you can only really see one of them, which is the home button that kind of reminds me of something. I've, I've seen it on another device, I'm pretty sure. But I just can't remember, it looks very familiar though. Anyway, upon powering it up, it reminded me of stock Android 5.0 Lollipop as the setup is almost identical to stock Android 5.0 Lollipop, which was very comforting to see. When I first saw the home screen though, I quickly realized that it wasn't stock Android as the icons are square and there is no app drawer. But it's not all bad since it's running Android 5.0 Lollipop as you can see here from the notification panel and the settings. It's also equipped with the new 64-bit octa-core Snapdragon 615 processor, as well as 2GB of RAM, which does really help make this device feel pretty fast and capable. I'll be sure to test it in my full review, but before I go, I do want to insert this footage of the ZTE Blade S6 and the iPhone 6 Plus next to each other. Let me know what you think of the ZTE Blade S6. It's priced at $249 off contract, which gets you Android 5.0 Lollipop, a Snapdragon 615 processor, LTE, a 13 megapixel camera sensor. Let me know what your thoughts are, I'm curious. But uh, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up as it does help show your support. With that said, I'm BoHD from PhoneDog.com and that is my unboxing of the ZTE Blade S6 here on PhoneDog. I hope you enjoyed this video, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one. So you saw that I was like, what? Man, that made me laugh, man. Man, dude, dude, man. that. That's crazy. That's crazy talk. Designed by ZTE? Come on now. In California? Yeah, right. Really? Really, guys? Saw it. Seriously? Seri Are we serious right now? Really? Okay, no, no, we're serious. Wow. That's pretty crazy.